This is Darius from therabbitpad.com, and in this video, I'm going to show you how you can remove shortcuts from Google Drive. If you need a little primer on what shortcuts are in Google Drive and how they work, you can click on the video that is appearing above, or you can look in the description. So I have a shortcut here called a gallery of photos, which is a shortcut to this file. If you already know the location of your file and you want to remove it, all you need to do is right click that file, then select move to trash. Then that shortcut is gone. However, if you want to search for all of the shortcuts that you have, you want to look at these search filter options and then select type, then select shortcuts. From there, it will show you all of the shortcuts that you have in your Google Drive account. The reason why these two are shaded out is because they are currently in the trash. So if I want to get rid of all of these shortcuts, you just click and drag your mouse, right click, and then select move to trash. And then all of those shortcuts will be gone. One good reason to use this filter instead of searching for the file is that when you create a shortcut, you can change the name of the shortcut file. For instance, I could change this file that's called a gallery of photos to something else. And I can just change it to a gallery. And, and when I change that file name to a gallery, the original file name remains the same. So see here, the original file still says a gallery of photos, but the shortcut says a gallery. So a really good reason for using this search filter is to find those shortcuts whose file names you may have changed. So this video shows you how to remove shortcuts from your Google Drive. If you found this video helpful, please click that like button and subscribe to this channel to view more helpful videos in the future. Also, please be sure to visit my website at therabbitpad.com.